to me, it's irresistible. A funny man is irresistible, more than any looks, more than any She anything. was always a sucker for a, a big laugh. A sucker for a laugh. I, I'm the best audience. That's legendary actor Gene Wilder and his third wife, Gilda Radner, gushing over each other when they sat down with E.T. in 1986. Gene died early Monday due to complications with Alzheimer's, and E.T. is taking a look back at their romance. She is my teacher because she tells the truth more than I do. When I am faced with a really tough one where I, I get hurt, I withdraw into what Gilda calls a dot. Dot man. And she <laughs> will lambast me until I have the courage to get angry with her, say respect her enough to get angry with her and let her have it, not in order to punish her, but to say what's truly on my heart, what hurt my feelings. Because if you harbor it, it comes out in another way. But if you say it at the time, it's gone five minutes later. It's gone. Maybe the next day. <laughs> or possibly in three years. But it does go yeah. away. Twelve years ago, it wouldn't have worked. At this minute right here, now specifically, yeah, we're happy. Um, yeah, we're happy. Yeah. The couple met while on set of their film Hanky Panky and married in 1984. Tragically, Jean lost Gilda to ovarian cancer in 1989.